Hello YouTube, today me and Matthew are going to play our first survival map that we're recording. The one that we're doing is the infamous Deep Space Turtle Chase. So let's go. Don't mean famous, because infamous means famous in a bad way. No, infamous means it's well known. Because it's very hard. Oh, uh, right. GR7 Security Division do orders for Professor Tagonist. Locate and apprehend known criminal Dr. Earl S. Testadine. Known to be working aboard one of the Let's just say it's very GR7 popular. mining facilities. If subject is under current contract with GR7 Mining Division, he is not to be removed from this position. Enter cryogenic stasis and await contract termination. Uh, midway frog, that my volume was high enough. Mm. I'll dump these back from the chest. They're red. Ah, uh, deceased. Nice. Massive organ phase of you. Okay. Mm -hmm. I love the sound effects from this. So do I. Also had a massive organ phase of you. Personal I wonder if they're twins. Nine nine. Lieutenant Gloria personal Lieutenant Gloria Jennings. They could be gun there. Date nine three three. I mean, about three two zero. More likely than you of think. All the when, where, and whom I have finally been chosen to work at GR 7s mining facility, past Tarsus three. They boast the richest pigment mines in the sector, and I hear that ever since Captain Schmidt signed on, their tests and returns have tripled. I'm really excited to work with him. My transport leaves for Tarsus 3 tomorrow. Wish me luck. Okay, now, do the number 2 for this person. Personal log, date 949.320. I have finally arrived. The mining facility is smaller than I expected, and apparently all pigment mine access is restricted to bots capable of working in zero PSI. I admit, I'm none too excited to be cryogenically on call, falling to troubleshoot a bug, and then refreezing awaiting the next. At least I get to work with JJ. He told me to call him that. Personal log. Date 082.321. Another month has passed. Five days a week, and two of those were for our bi-weekly meetings. Only 1,522 cognizant hours left. At this rate, I just might finish my contract early. I notice someone new has filled the space in Chamber 4, but I can't find out anything about him. He's creeping me out. What kind of person goes into cryo freeze with their eyes open? Unbelievable! The enormous labor I took to cover my tracks failed to impede the apes at GR7 security from planting a mindless goon in the station. The fool did not even take the time to hide his thaw date. A sly glance at his incubation log shows he is to thaw mere minutes before me. Ha! With one line of code, I can switch our thaw time. I am sick of running. I am not sorry for what I did, and these idiots didn't even notice me under their very noses stealing pigment for our cause. Well, I will end the chase. I've called in some favors and plan on faking my own death. Brilliant! <laughs> A shame it will require so many other real deaths. <laughs> Let's go indeed. Climb up the ladder. Make sure you climb up the right ladder. Okay. That's locked up in here. Important message from Dr. Tester. Ah, <sighs> Dr. T. I Is know Dr. you genius types have a hard time with remembering such menial things, so I'll say it simple like. This is an emergency plug. Anyway. When you're done with your experiments, return it to the botanicals doorway so that in case of a power outage, 
we don't all wake up to a pile of dead plants and no oxygen. It'd be pretty awesome if we could get through this map, wouldn't it? I want to read the Voxel Reader first. I guess I'll take container B. No, it doesn't. Hang on. Player two. Here we go. Off we go. Got a load of minecarts following us. Yeah, because they've got no players in, I think they have less mass uh, or something. Or something, so they, yeah, they go slower. I know. Right. Disaster. Look at the pretty stars! Should be. Should be. Uh huh. Pretty. I like the music. You can still hear some music, can't you? Yeah. Oh no! Neither do I. Maybe it decides to bang your head against the ceiling. What, for you? Oh yeah, it did for me as well. I thought you meant it got rid of two of your actual pieces, you know. Like to help them boost something. Going forwards! Eh? Whoosh. Awesome! Yeah, and there's some redstone too. I think I can see where we're going now. So it did. Danger onboard explosion detected. Incredible. Oh, no. Our new UGR7 security guys were built. I want tough, some minecarts. Buying yourself from Cryo. Where can I buy that level of bionics? Oh, here we go. I'm Schmidt, by the way. We were. I got a Metrovox car. You arrested Doctor T. That was before that bastard killed everyone on station just to get away. Awesome. What's it's no this wonder stuff? He's a wanted criminal. What's this stuff that I can walk through? Seems to have some. No, this, there's a block in front of the water, if which seems to be... Docking at Ares, you can no, it might be a sign, maybe. It might be an the invisible sign. Is that no, that old about abandoned it. bucket of bolts still has enough components left So I'm sure if I broke one, then the water would come flowing what's left of the engines on, then fire up the So I don't want to The Spectres used to make really robust hardware. Maybe it still works. 
Of course, the, if of course they'll be relifed back on Pangea. Yeah, but, but these yeah, ones you can the walk through. Those of us awake when the attack started rushed to the escape pods and launched immediately. I made it away, but not before taking a few anyway, let's go. rounds to the bad place. Long range so comms and sensors What's are missing, here? and the Nothing. replicator won't make anything but gruel. No. Well, I'll read. I'll read one. Oh, if I'll read a couple. On the way down. Oh, and if you haven't yet, make sure you stop Urgent at the direct message, essential right? downtime or bed unit. Sleeping in one of these bed units will cause it to begin producing supplementary organic cells compatible with your biochemistry, capable of rejuvenating Redstone you from ore. even the most serious of injuries. I feel very sleepy. I suspect these might be cakes. You think? Anyway, I'm gonna give you half the med pack crunchy if you stop walking into me. There you go. Eight med pack crunches. How many do you have now? I have nine. Okay. There you go. I found jump up there. Wrong side. How on earth did you get up there? Yeah, you can. Let's go and get some med packs or something. Yeah. More crunchies. Going to organize some stuff in my inventory. Yeah, I went and got the power plug. All right. I'm just, just organizing some stuff in my inventory. I'm coming now. Yes, I made it across first time. Down there. Okay. It's quite a large jumping puzzle, isn't it? Hmm. Ooh, quite large. There go. Can't seem to find a way up. Oh, there. There's one. There's one. There we go. It's not a signpost. And then I fell. Press shift. Oh, you could just do that, yeah. Okay. Can you move out the way? Move to the side, please. There we go. I'm just trying to work out this jump. Mm. I am just thinking about it now. I think it's a long jump. So it is. Teleport to me again. Alright, I'm just going to... Oh, teleport, yeah. I'm holding you. Now I... Oh. Now oh. I'm suffocating. Yeah, I'll give you all my stuff in case I lose it. When in case. Jump. So, there's oh. the power plug. That's all you really need. And then you got it again. Back up. There's a power plug. Look after it. 
No. Oh, plugs. And then I throw it out for some random reason. I don't need to. Hello. All right, I'm just going to puke out plug to you. Yeah. Which we can't actually eat. Yeah. It doesn't. There's nothing back here. Then you go up to there. I'm stuck. There we go. Uh. Let us through. Uh, okay. We'll end part one there, so we'll see what happened in part two.